Well, look, in Washington, D.C., I'm not from Washington. There's more than enough hypocrisy to go around. And what you see with a lot of these politicians who have been here for decades and, you know, one politician who's running against the president who's been here for almost half a century, uh, they're very quick to criticize but very slow to provide actual solutions. And I will say for this country during the pandemic, all the different things you mentioned were things that only a entrepreneur, only a businessman, and only a creative thinker and a real leader would have been able to do. And President Trump took this seriously from the very start. He got organized. He uh, dealt with these unprecedented challenges in ways where a lot of the worst fears and what we saw in a lot of other countries didn't manifest themselves. They said we would have uh, shortages on the frontline workers of PP&E. They said that we were going to have people dying uh, because they weren't going to have ventilators. That didn't happen. Uh, New York was a hospital system was about to be overrun. We spent tons of money. We got them. Uh, the Javits Center expanded. We sent them the mercy and the comfort and we were tracking on a day-to-day -day their ventilator need and we got them everything they needed to get them through and now uh, with vaccines the fastest vaccine ever to a, a phase three trial was 13 months president trump got it done in four months and then he did the second one in four months in a week and we have multiple vaccines now in phase three, phase three trials which will allow us to get to the end of this pandemic faster than anyone thought possible so uh, again president trump's leadership has been incredible throughout this pandemic